Hello guys, through this video, you are going to learn about cauliflower mosaic virus. Cauliflower mosaic virus is a double stranded DNA plant virus coming under the family Colimoviridae. Member of the family Colimoviridae of genus Colimovirus, the CAM virus infects mostly plant of the family Brassicaceae, but some cauliflower mosaic virus strains are a also able to infect Solanaceae members. The structure of the Colimo mosaic virus, here the cauliflower mosaic virus is an icosahedron with the diameter of 52 nanometer built from 420 calci protein subunits arranged with a triangular T is equal to 7 which surrounds a solvent filled centenary cavity or the central cavity. <coughs> the cauliflower mosaic virus contains a circular double stranded DNA molecule of about 80 kilobytes interrupted by NICs that results from the action of RNAs page during reverse transcription. These NICs come from the MET tRNA and two RNA primers used in reverse transcription. After entering the host cell, this single stranded NICs in a viral DNA are repaired forming a supercoiled molecules that binds to histones. This DNA is transcribed into a full length, terminally reductant, 35 years RNA and a subgenomic 19 years RNA. This is the structure of cauliflower mosaic virus. Now we pass on to the genome of cauliflower mosaic virus. Here, the cauliflower, the promoter of the 35 years RNA is a very strong constitutive, constitutive promoter responsible for the transcription of the whole cauliflower mosaic genome. It is well known for its use in plant transformation. It causes high levels of gene expression in dicot plants. It is less effective in monocot, especially in cereals. The differences in behavior are possibly due to differences in quality and or quality, quantity of regulatory factors. The promoter was named CAM35 promoter because the coefficient of sedimentation of the viral transcript whose expression is naturally driven by this promoter is 35 years. It is one of the most widely used general purpose constructive constitutive promoters. It was discovered at the beginning of the 190s. The 35 years RNA is particularly complex containing a highly structured 600 nucleotide long leader sequence with the 6 to 8 short open reading frame. The open reading frame 1 is a movement protein. Here the open reader reading frame 2, aphid insect transmission factors, open reading frame 3, vir virion associated protein, structural protein, DNA binding capabilities, ORF4 capsid protein, ORF5 protease, bifunctional reverse transcriptase and RNAsH. ORF6, here, here the translation activator, inclusion body formation, trafficking possibly more functions. ORF7, that is unknown. In addition to its functions regarding translational activation and formation of new inclusion bodies, P6 has been shown to interact with the number of other CAM virus proteins such as P2 and P3, suggesting that 
It may also contribute in some degree to viral assembly and aphid mediated transmission. In addition, P6 has been shown to bind to P7. Investigating interactions between two may help to elucidate the as yet unknown function of P7. Another function of P6 involves modification of host non-expressor of pathogenesis related one during the course of infections. Now we pass on to the replication of cauliflower mosaic virus. Here the cauliflower mosaic virus replicates by reverse transcription method. Viral particles enter a plant cell here. First the virus particle enters the plant cell and are unencapsidated. At this stage the viral DNA consists of three fragments one on the strand and the two on plus strands which are imperfectly assembled into a circular genome with three gaps or discontinuities here D1, D2 and D3. The viral DNA enters the nucleus where the discontinuities are filled in here. It is filled, enter into the nucleus, it is filled in at this point the viral DNA also associated with the host histones forming a mini chromosome. The host DNA dependent RNA polymerase transcribes from the 35S promoters all the way around the viral genome surpassing the 35S promoter here all the way this one okay. Transcription also initiated at the 19S promoters. The viral RNAs pass into the host cytoplasm where they are transcribed. Next, the 3' prime end of uh, tRNA annihilates to a site corresponding to discontinuity that is D1 site discontinuity end of the 35 s RNA. The tRNA primes synthesized by the viral reverse transcriptase of a new strand here this one the tRNA okay. The RNAs H remove the RNA from the DNA RNA duplex leaving behind the RNA. Yes, it is replaced and leaving behind the DNA. This new DNA binds the 35S promoter at the 3' prime end of the RNA template and synthesis of alpha strands of DNA continues and RNAs H continues to degrade RNA complex to DNA. Here this one. The synthesis of the alpha strand complex RNAs H activity exposes purine rich regions at the position of discontinuity which primes the synthesis of the alpha DNA strands. RNAs H activity exposes purine rich regions at the position of discontinuity which primes here which primes the synthesis of the beta DNA strands when the new strand of DNA reaches the 5 prime end of the new strands it switches to the 5 prime of the new strand the, the uh, react recreating discontinuity. When the new strands of DNA reaches the 5 prime of the new beta strand, it displaces the prime and some of the newly synthesized beta strand resulting in the recreation of discontinuity. When the new beta strands of DNA reaches the 5 prime end of the new uh, gamma strand, it dis displaces the primer and some of the newly synthesized strands resulting in creation of recreation of discontinuity. Okay. Now advantages of cauliflower mosaic virus. Cauliflower mosaic virus a promoter is used in most of the transgenic crops to activate foreign genes which have been artificially inserted into the most host plants. It is inserted into the transgenic plants in a form which is different 
from that found when it is present in its natural brassica plant host. This is enabled to operate in a wide range of host organisms environment which would otherwise not be possible. The greatest advantage of the CAM genome is its promoter which is widely used in gene engineering constructs due to its highly high activity, absence of tissue specificity and ability to induce expression of foreign genes not only in cruciferacy but also in plants from other families. Transmission of the cauliflower mosaic virus. Here there is a very simple transmission. The virus is occurred from an infected host during feeding by the aphid vectors. To occur a transmissible complex is composed of virions and proteins P2 located in the vector stylates. The P2N terminal domains recognize the protein receptor located at the tip of the stylet and the P2 C terminal dominant binds to the P3 decorated virions. The mode of acquisition by the vector is controlled by the tissue and intracellular specific localization. This protein is only found in epidermis and parenchyma cells. Moreover, in these cells, the P2 is localized in single viral electron lucent infusions, inclusions bodies. In host cells, viral protein P2 and P3 are first produced in numerous viral factories and are later exported and co-localized with microtubules before con concentrating in ELIB. Here the cauliflower mosaic virus specifically uses the microtubules to form the transmissible body and thus enable vector transmission. The complete molecular characterizations and uh, uh, study is not uh, carried out further but anyhow the transmission of cauliflower mosaic virus is only because of the aphid insect. Now we pause on to the immunity. Here the plants depends on natural defense mechanism, rely on own immune system. Uh, prevention uh, we can prevent uh, because uh, uh, it is difficult to prevent. Transmission by aphids, any pesticides can be used. Silver grain netting can be done. Disinfecting tools and the equipments reduces the infection of uh, Infection if uh, harbored, keep weeds away, remove infected plants to stop spreading of infection. 20 is to 2 is to 1 ratio, water is to vinegar is to brown sugar spray can be used to trap adults. Chemical prevention by using an abamectin, methylamine, imidacloprid can be used to eradicate the cauliflower mosaic virus. These all are the questions. Please go through this. Book for reference, Biotechnology by Sadhya Narayana. Thank you girls.